Welcome to the Thrift Store Rundown, where we bring Hollywood home on a budget. This is Enter the Matrix, the PC game with an original story written and directed by the Wachowski Brothers, who were responsible for the four-time Academy Award-winning film, The Matrix. This is bought for $4.99. The overview video can be found by clicking in the description box below. This is going to be the installation video. I hope it will install. I mean, there's no excuse for it not to. These are the system requirements. It will work on Windows XP. It should translate <coughs> very well into um, Windows 7, which is my operating system. Excuse me, please. I need a little ice tea. I always drink something before I record a video, just to get my mind cleared up. Anyway, we have the little instruction manual with gameplay and credits. Plus, the disc itself. Actually, there's more than one disc in Enter the Matrix. There are four discs, including three play discs and one installation. So, I'm just going to put in the installation disc and we're moving the installation disc now. This one, two, Three and a play disc. I do not know which one goes first, so I will have to take a look at the manual. Which disc do I enter to install? Table of contents for the instruction manual. Set up an installation. The game disc goes into the CD ROM drive. I guess I should enter the play disc first. I'll check back. I believe it is our fate to be here. It is our destiny. I believe this night holds for each and every one of us the very meaning of our lives. This is a war, and we are soldiers. What if tomorrow the war could be over? Isn't that worth fighting for? Isn't that worth dying for? So here goes the play disc, insert into the DVD-ROM drive, CD-ROM drive. Would you like to install Enter the Matrix at this time? That's the point of the video. Oh, <laughs> One disc. It says to install disc one first. Let's take the play disc out. Disc one. Everything is war here on the thrift store. Run down. We show you every mistake as it happens. Okay, so I just inserted the first disc. And once again, there are four discs in this game. I think this will be the game proper disc. But nonetheless, the point of this video is to install Enter the Matrix into my computer. This is the install sealed wizard. For Enter the Matrix. Everything is being done in real time. Alright, progress is being made. It is installing the files onto my hard drive. Keanu Reeves looking all sleek, sly, and ready to murder. First phase of installation complete. Now I must insert the second the second installation disc into the hard drive. So I'm going to take out the first installation disc now. And I will now insert the second. Disc 2 into the hard drive. 
We are now inserting disk 3 into the hard drive because setup has been paused. Inserting the fourth and final disk, which is the play disk. If all goes well, Enter the Matrix should be both compatible and beautifully playable for my computer. So let's get this party started right, and right now. We're getting to the last leg of installation, which is installing the sound design. Dane Davis won the Oscar for his sound design, and it won another Oscar for sound mixing. Don Davis' score is also being imposed into the game, with Eric Lundberg's additional aid in that. And as the installation continues, various screenshots from the game are being displayed. My version of DirectX meets system requirements. See, I told you there should be no reason why this won't work. Well, let's just start another time. I really rarely register games. Alright. We're about ready to find out if End of the Matrix is playable for my computer. It has met all the system requirements. Hmm. Ooh. Resolution. Whatever. I want to play. I'll deal with that later. The point of the video is to just get this thing installed. This is a very good sign. Atari. English language, please. All right, enter the Matrix. I don't believe it. This game should be fantastic. I do not think the Wachowski brothers, the correct way to pronounce their last name, would ever anticipate their film, The Matrix, beating Star Wars The Phantom Menace to win all four of the Oscars that it was nominated for. The two I've already mentioned, sound and sound mixing, plus film editing for Zach Stanberg, and for visual effects led by John Gotta. In the end, The Matrix received critical acclaim and will be forever engraved in the hearts of sci-fi fans and action thriller fans worldwide. As for me, I'm not a big gamer, but anything from a film or television show that becomes a game for PC, I'm going to be down with. Thanks for watching the Thrift Store Rundown, where we bring Hollywood home on a budget. If you like these kind of videos, I'll be starting to do a couple more. I got a couple CSI games that I think you'll like. In the meantime, you can check out the overview of the Enter the Matrix game. Click here, or click the video on the bottom to check out The Matrix Revisited, the behind the scenes of how they made the film. Thanks for watching.